1536, England's King Henry VIII accused his second wife, Anne Boleyn, who had been crowned queen in 1533, of charges including adultery, incest and conspiracy against the king. At her trial, she was found guilty and on May 19, 1536, she was taken to Tower Green in London, where she was beheaded by a French swordsman rather than the standard axe-wielding executioner. Historians believe the charges against her were false, issued by Henry VIII to remove Boleyn as his wife and enable him to marry his third wife, Jane Seymour, in hopes of producing a male heir. Anne Boleyn fell from Henry VIII's favour when she failed to give birth to a male heir. In 1533, she bore a female child who would grow up to be Queen Elizabeth I, but Anne suffered miscarriages and her only male child was still born in January 1536. At that point, Henry decided to make a change. He had been having adulterous relationships with two of the Queen's maids of honor, Madge Shelton and Jane Seymour. The latter was fast gaining the King's esteem. Meanwhile, Boleyn and Cromwell were clashing on matters of foreign policy and the King's finances. Historians are divided on the extent of Cromwell's motives behind facilitating Boleyn's demise but in setting up the charges against her he was certainly carrying out the king's wishes. Cromwell was part of a secret commission, one that included Boleyn's father to investigate her wrongdoing. Historians speculate that her father probably tried to warn her of the situation. But there was little she could do. Boleyn was accused of sexual affairs with male members of her court who in some cases were tortured into making confessions. In addition, she was accused of incest with her own brother and of using sorcery to bewitch the king. Boleyn was sent to confinement in the Tower of London and her trial took place on May 15, 1536. She was found guilty by a jury that included her own uncle and a former fiancé. By sending Anne to her death, Henry VIII cleared the way to marry Seymour which he did on May 30th just a few days after Boleyn's beheading.